It's episode 36, 36, woo, woo. Hey everybody, Katie Lance here, founder and CEO of Katie Lance Consulting, the Get Social Smart Academy and author of the Get Social Smart book. And today we're gonna talk about how do you talk about your business on your personal profile, otherwise known as the 20% rule. So if you've been following me for any amount of time, you know that I'm a big believer on your personal social media profiles, especially on Facebook. Your personal Facebook profile should, in my opinion, follow the 80-20 rule. 80% of what you post should be personal because Facebook is personal. That's what the place where you talk about your family and your friends and your kids and your hobbies and your passions and your pets. And if you're like me, I share lots of photos of my two boys, a great glass of wine, cup of coffee, my travels. So 80% should be personal. The other 20% is business. And this is where a lot of people get a little hung up. When I say use your personal profile for business 20% of the time, what I mean by that is think about ways that you can intentionally connect with people by using your personal profile. So there's two quick tips I wanna give you. First of all, really utilize Facebook lists. If you're not setting up private Facebook lists where you're putting your clients, your family, your friends into specific lists within your personal profile, they're missing a really, really uh, huge opportunity because when you can organize your friends and your clients and your prospects into, into lists on your personal profile, this will allow you to take a few minutes every day, look at your lists, look at your clients, look at the people you really wanna connect with for business, and then take a few minutes to like or comment or engage with people in a really real and authentic way. Don't just click like for the sake of clicking like, but use Facebook as a way to build those relationships for business. So that's first and foremost. The second thing is you can certainly post about your business or post about what you're doing, but I really encourage you to think about it, not necessarily in terms of just blasting out, you know, sales information or, uh, yeah, I have a new listing, especially for all my real estate friends, but really looking at moments of opportunity. Look at your life as content. If you have an open house, maybe you post a beautiful photo of the front door or the gorgeous backyard or the cookies that you're about to serve, right? So looking for those little moments of opportunity and when in doubt, Think about why you love what you do. When you come up, come from a place of truly loving what you do, when you talk about that on your personal profile, it doesn't seem salesy or businessy because it's just part of who you are, right? So again, follow that 80-20 rule, especially on your personal profile with Facebook. 80% personal, 20% business. Use Facebook lists and really get intentional, intentional, intentional about the way you're connecting with people. My last bonus tip, by the way, is join some relevant Facebook groups that are relevant to your community or your industry. There's some great Facebook groups that will allow you to really shine and to answer questions and be really that voice of authority without, again, promoting yourself in a super uh, salesy way. All right, so those are my quick tips on that 20% rule. I'd love to hear what you think. Leave me a comment below. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, if you'd like more information and more tips, tools, and strategies, please visit us at katielance.com.